Welcome to the Accu web hosting video tutorial. Today, we will guide you on how to connect Windows VPS using the Google Chrome Remote Desktop. If you want a PDF file of this video tutorial, you can download it from our Telegram channel, Accu web hosting. We have mentioned our Telegram channel link in the description. Kindly click on the link and find the PDF file of this video tutorial. Before we begin, take a look at AccuWebHosting.com to review various hosting services offered by us. You can contact us through chat, phone, or send us an email at sales at AccuWebHosting.com. Let's begin the tutorial. What is Chrome Remote Desktop? Chrome Remote Desktop is a remote desktop software tool developed by Google. It allows a user to control another computer's desktop through a browser. You can control another computer from any computer running on Windows, Mac OS, or Linux. Additionally, you can use an iOS or Android mobile device to access a computer remotely. Chrome Remote Desktop is free. You do not have to pay for any commercial tools if your needs are limited to connecting to your own devices or accessing your friend's devices. Another good thing about Chrome Remote Desktop is that it is pretty easy to set up, and you don't have to be a tech guru to get it up and running. The only requirement for Chrome Remote Desktop is having a Google account and the Google Chrome browser. Let's set up Chrome Remote Desktop to access your Windows VPS. Step 1 is to log in into the VPS using the Remote Desktop application. We have successfully logged in into the VPS. Step 2 is to install the Google Chrome web browser on the VPS. We have successfully installed the Chrome web browser on the VPS. Step 3. Log in to your Google email account. Here we are using our Gmail account video.accuwebhosting at gmail.com. You will have to set up your Gmail account. We have successfully set up Gmail account on VPS. Now visit the remote desktop.google.com slash access on your VPS. Click the download button underneath. Set up remote access. Once you click the download button, the Chrome Web Store window will open to download Chrome Remote Desktop. Click on the Add to Chrome to download the Chrome Remote Desktop extension. Now follow the on-screen directions to download and install Chrome Remote Desktop. Once the Chrome Remote Desktop extension is installed, you will see the message Chrome Remote Desktop has been added to Chrome. Once the Chrome Remote Desktop host is installed, you will see the pop-up window with the Ready to Install message. Click on the Accept and Install button under the Ready to Install window. By clicking the Yes button, allow the Chrome Remote Desktop host to open the Chrome Remote Desktop host.mc file. Allow the Google Chrome installer by clicking the Yes button. 
once Chrome Remote Desktop has been installed. You'll need to complete a few setup steps before you can dive into connecting remotely. You will see the window to choose a name. Here you can enter your VPS hostname or IP address of VPS to identify the server easily. Once you enter the name, click on the next button. The most important setting is creating a PIN to ensure your computer is secure. Enter a PIN that is at least 6 numbers long. For security reasons, the longer, the better. Ideally, avoid using obvious to guess numbers such as a birthday or memorable date. Once you set up a PIN click on the start button. Your device is listed under the Chrome Remote Desktop list once you log in. From there, it's possible to rename the device by clicking the pencil icon next to it if you choose to come up with a more memorable name. Congratulations! You have successfully set up Chrome Remote Desktop on your VPS. Let's set up a remote desktop on your local system from you connect your Windows VPS. Please note that you have to use the same Google account on the local system which you have set up on VPS. We are using same email account video.acuwebhosting at gmail.com in our local system. You will have to use same account as you have set up on VPS. Visit https colon slash slash remote desktop dot google dot com slash access slash and set up the Chrome remote desktop application. Now click on the remote access device. As we have set up Accu Web Hosting VPS in our Windows VPS you can see the same device is showing in the screen. Enter the PIN which you have set in VPS. Once you enter the PIN click on the arrow button. Once the VPS is connected you will see the VPS screen. In middle of the browser screen you will see one arrow. Click on the arrow button. You will see many options to manage your VPS. Click on the Control Alt or Delete button to log in into VPS. Now you will see the VPS users. Click on the user in which you wish to log in. Now enter the password of the user and press Enter. Once the VPS is connected you will see your VPS screen in the browser and you can manage it easily. You can also change some settings for the experience to be more convenient. When you connect it to VPS, a panel on the right hand side offers a number of session options. It is possible to switch to full screen mode, and scale the remote desktop to fit on your screen. Options for switching between displays are also possible if the remote device has more than one screen connected to it. Other important settings include the ability to press Ctrl plus Alt plus Dell on the remote computer or print screen, with other key mappings able to be configured. Via the panel, users can also upload or download files between the two systems too. Once you finished your work on VPS you can close the session easily. You can either close the browser tab to finish the session or click on the disconnect button from the panel on the right hand side. You have successfully disconnected from the VPS. Now if you wish to reconnect the VPS simply access remote desktop.google.com slash access on Chrome browser and press on the remote device. Enter the PIN and click on the arrow button. You have again successfully logged in into the VPS. Let's quickly sum up the context of this video. We saw how to connect Windows VPS using the Google Chrome Remote Desktop. Hope this video will be helpful for you. If you like our technical videos, please press the subscribe button and bell icon to receive instant notification of our new videos.
Each like is important to us so do not forget to symbol us. To download a PDF file of this video, please subscribe to our Telegram channel, AccuWeb Hosting, where you will have access to the PDF files of all our videos. Thank you for watching.